This is Spanish 3, sentences 205 through 208. I'm going to read the following four sentences in English, then Spanish, then clap. And after I clap, I'd like you to repeat just the Spanish with me. Here we go. 205. I have spoken with his older sisters. Yo he hablado con sus hermanas mayores. Yo he hablado con sus hermanas mayores. 206. Ask your friend, have you eaten the cookie? Has comido tú la galleta? Has comido tú la galleta? 207. He has told us the truth. Él nos ha dicho la verdad. Él nos ha dicho la verdad. And finally, 208. Have they written the letter? Han escrito ellos la carta? Han escrito ellos la carta? Now, this is present perfect. Have spoken, have eaten. I'm going to say the past participle, which is the spoken, written part, in English, then Spanish, and clap, and I'd like you to repeat the English and the Spanish. Hablar turns into hablado. Hablar turns into hablado. Comer turns into comido. Comer turns into comido. Decir turns into dicho. Decir turns into dicho. Escribir turns into escrito. Escribir turns into escrito. Okay? Now, I want you to notice there are statements and questions. Uh, the question, in English we say, have you eaten the cookie? Okay? Have eaten you the cookie? Remember, the word order is different in Spanish. <clears throat> if I say, you are tall, that's a statement. But if I switch and say, are you tall, that's a question. So, have eaten you? Um, have written they? Also, there are a couple tricky words on here. Everybody say, galleta. Galleta. Galleta's cookie. You know at Sam's and Costco, they have ladies that hand out cookies, and sometimes they'll let you have more than one, which is nice. That gal let me have a cookie. Everybody, that gal let me have a cookie. Now, verdad is true or truth. You can say uh, verdad with a D or verdad with a TH. Listen and repeat. It's very important to tell your dad the truth. It's very important to tell your dad the truth. Great. This has been Spanish 3, sentences 205 through 208.